Welcome back guys, so in this video I'll be showing you some gameplays of Chorus, Dave the Diver and FC24 running on my Xiaomi Pad 6 using GeForce Now for play and Boostroid Android Cloud Game Streaming Services. I'll kick things off with Chorus. We'll be running using the free Japan based server of GeForce Now. At the moment this service is not available in my country that is India so I use the free version of Proton VPN. Connect to Japan region, first the stream starts I disconnect from the VPN, show you the stream settings. No VPN is running in the background, server location Japanese, test network, tab is connected to a 5GHz band Wi-Fi channel, getting a latency of around 145 milliseconds. Stream resolution set to 1920 by 1200 pixels, 16 is to 10 aspect ratio, frame rate set to 60. I'll connect to the VPN now. I'll be running the demo of Chorus available on Steam Store. It's a space combat game played from a third person perspective. The game's protagonist Nara pilots a sentient Starcraft known as Forsaken. Forsaken can be armed with a variety of weapons such as missile launchers, gatling guns and laser cannons. It also has 3 slots for mods which can be used to alter the ship's performance in combat. The game is set in an open world and the players can complete various optional quests. Tap on play. Since I am using the free tier of GeForce now there will be a waiting queue. Looking for the next available rig, 17 gamers ahead of me. The game started directly, I will disconnect from the VPN, connect it to Japan. Enable the performance overlay, tap on the three dots, tap on statistics. This server has GTX 1060 GPU. You can see the in-game and streams FPS here. Connected my DualSense controller to the tab via Bluetooth mode. Getting a ping of around 145 milliseconds. Show you the display settings, resolution set to 1920 by 1200 pixels. By default, preset has been set to epic. I'll stick with the default settings. There is a spacecraft, its name is Forsaken. Let me just check out the controls, fire weapons by holding the right trigger. I need to take out this spacecraft, charge vulture. Need to avoid getting hit. Dodge by clicking the left and last leg. Need to do it one more time. I need to dodge right before the attack lands. Yeah, I was successful. Try to take out this spacecraft now. Chasing it. He was running very smoothly. Okay, this spacecraft has a shield. I need to slow down. There you go, finally. Took it out. Our character Nara. We are interacting with Forsaken, our spacecraft. Objectives. Boost. Save the refugees. I can scan the area by pressing the A key. It's called Right of the Senses. It highlights the mission relevant objects in the environment. Press A to hail the refugee ship. Life signs on board. Interacting with the captain. Locate the Nima. Objective complete. Excellent performance. Game is definitely playable using GeForce now. I'll be trying out the next game. Now I'll be running FC24, Steam version of the game using Boostroid. Need to have Boostroid's paid membership in order to play the game. You also need to own the game. There it is. Install and play. Tap on OK, let's go. 
Okay, they ran a network test for me. Got a latency of around 180 milliseconds and a bandwidth of around 78 megabits per second. Need to sign into my Steam account. I'll just scan the QR code using Steam's Android application. Also need to sign into my EA Play account. Location of the server. I cannot pronounce the name of the city. Serbia based server. Steam started. Waiting for the game to start. Let me just check my library. I do have the game in it. There's FC24. Play. Accept. EA Play will start. Running install script. EA anti cheat. EA Play is starting. Finally, the game started. EA games for you. Video settings, full HD resolution, frame rate set to 60. I'll stick with the default settings. Alright, match is going on. Using the server based server from India, so some input delay is inevitable. Here it does seem to be manageable. It's a shame that Bootstroid still does not have any servers in Asia. I lost the ball. Got it again. Going to be a free kick. Okay, got the free kick. Let's try this. Could not capitalize to get the ball. Yeah, got it. <laughs> Lost it again. Not observing any audio setting, picture quality looks crisp. Have a chance. Not sure which key to press in order to shoot. Chance. Oh, that was close. Now I'll be running one of the biggest hits of 2023, Dave the Diver, using OnePlay Android Cloud Game Simming Service. In this game, players control Dave, a hardworking diver, as he collects fish, solves quests, and manages a sushi restaurant. Game has elements of management, action, adventure, and role playing. Need to have OnePlay's paid membership in order to play the game. You also need to own the game, Steam version of it. I am subscribed to one of OnePlay's early plans. This setting is checked. Show gameplay settings before launch. Resolution on the stream full HD, FPS set to 60, bitrate set to 20 megabits per second, advanced game options, show set setting enable, launch the game. Getting an average network latency of around 30 milliseconds, scan the QR code, sign into my Steam account. Location of the server Mumbai Maharashtra, sign into my Steam account, game is launching, downloading content for it, I'll just wait. It started, handy game, not demanding on the hardware, settings, resolution set to full HD. That's it. Start the game. Alright, the game has started. There's our character Dave. I need to catch 7 fish for the sushi bar. Chef will be preparing some dishes. And earthquake caused some damage to the bar. It's up to us to repair it. Oxygen level, it's depleting. Depth. I'm carrying a dive knife. There it is. You can use it to hunt the fish. Also carrying a harpoon. There you go. Caught a fish. Prepare sushi ingredients. A second fish. FPS is around 60 very nicely on one play missed keep missing with my shots <laughs> and again almost there One more fish and we are done here. Oh, 
objective complete I'll return to the boat swim to the surface go back to sushi bar our friend blue hole mission completed ingredients collected Use the boat to return to the bar. There's the bar. Chef, check the menu. New recipes need to be added to the menu before they can be sold to customers. Sushi recipe. Register this to the menu. Clownfish. Okay, pork cobra green tea, our friend. I need to pour the right amount of tea. Don't want to spill it. Stop here. Good. Chef is preparing a dish. Wait until the cooking is done. I'll be serving the dish to Cobra. Last words in quickly. He's on a call. Oh, he left. Throw it. I beg your pardon. Throw away the food. Discard it. Cannot serve it to another customer. So, excellent performance. Game is definitely playable using one play. I'll end the video here guys. I hope you found it useful. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.